don't know, it's KJ Lewis, that's why. <laughs> Welcome back to Night Overtime. Last Friday night, Eastwood locked the upright district, ex outright, excuse me, District 1-6A championship with a win at home over Franklin. Yeah, the Troopers are assured of a home playoff game, but they want to do something today, had the chance to do something that is not easy to do, and that is go undefeated through an entire District 1-6A slate. The Troopers sitting at 8-1, 7-0 in district on the road at Eastlake, trying to make that a shiny 9-1, 8-0 record in district by the end of the day, and they got off to a strong hard start. Evan Minjades, up top to Evan Macias, the Evan to Evan connection, Ed. Hey, everybody has a plan until they get punched in the mouth. Eastwood's been punching all season long. Yeah, they have had a lot of close games. This one, not really one of them, although Luke Lomo leads the ball there, 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 there. Makes it seven to seven in the first quarter, but then it's Minjades finding Macias once again for the touchdown. They would roll basically from there, Jason. They will get the win 56 to 22 as Jaden Martinez will score here. Jason, what do you like about their chances in the postseason? I like them a lot, and it all starts off with that first game of the season. Getting them ready with South Lake Curl. Coach Lopez has done a great job getting that team ready. Again, 56 22, Eastwood over Eastlake. They finished the season 9 and 1, 8 0 in district play. Heading into the postseason, we'll show you their playoff matchup in just a minute. There was some interest in the late game at the sack tonight, too. America's battling Socorro. A win would secure the Trailblazers the fourth and final spot in District 16A. No mark more for the Trailblazers, but Alexander Ortiz stepping up and calling his own number there for the score. Later on, America's kept their foot on the gas pedal. This one going to Anthony Miranda. Ed, America's just your thoughts on the season they put together this year. Uh, you know, they've been fighting every week. Anthony Miranda, one of the top playmakers on that team. Cameron Johnson back uh, this week. It was good to see him out there running hard. There you go. America's going on to secure a 45-17 win over Socorro to lock in their playoff spot.